Hi, everybody. It's Faith and Fire Sign Tarot. Hope everyone's well. Libra. I'm sorry. It's been a while. Don't hate me. I had a bit of a journey I had to go on, and I had to realign some things in my physical life to bring back around the spiritual so I could do this. So, that being said, we're going to throw your cards down for February 2023. Thanks for coming down and hanging out. Hold up. I tip down. Getting a little ahead of myself here. Heavenly Father, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides and Archangels, I ask that you be with me. Help me see what I need to see, hear what I need to hear, feel what I need to feel, and speak what I need to speak to bring my Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus friends to their highest good. I thank you for your presence. And I thank you for the blessings you've given me. Let's pass them on to my Libra friends. From the Wisdom Oracle, one to show and one to go. One to show and one to go. Yes. Yang, number one, Yang, 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 oh my goodness. You know, it's the first card. You'd think it'd be easier. Okay. The masculine principle of movement and creative activity. The power that makes things happen. Taking action. Okay. As a Libra rising, I can say this. Not the most decisive. Libra, you're just not. Sometimes you have trouble making up your mind. It's because you're able to see both sides and all angles. I get that. Okay. My classic sugar skull. You guys miss this? I love this. Okay. Fire, earth, air, water, fire, earth, air, water, speak truth, speak truth. Fire, earth, air, water, fire, earth, air, water, speak truth. Speak truth. Fire, earth, air, water, fire, earth, air, water. Speak truth. Speak truth. The fool and the lovers reversed. Hmm. Fire, earth, air, water. Speak truth. Speak truth. More indecision as you go down this new path. Should I stay or should I go? Fire, earth, air, water, speak truth. Speak truth. Fire, earth, air, water, speak truth. Speak truth. Holy Moses, here we go. The tower, the ace of pentacles reversed, the ace of cups reversed. Oh. Temperance. And the Three of Cups. Ace of Wands in the upright at the bottom of the deck. Yang taking action. The tower. The unavoidable catastrophe that you saw coming a mile away. Hmm. Lightning has struck the tower. The tower has fallen. What has happened cannot be undone. The tower can, however, be rebuilt. 
point you saw this coming. And if you didn't, you didn't have your eyes open because you always see the storm coming from a mile away. You feel the rumble before the earthquake. You see the cloud before the lightning. It was not avoidable. The tower spares no one, but towers are good because they clear the way for what's supposed to be there. If the tower fell, it's because the universe knocked it down for you. Because you weren't going to do it. Just throwing that out there. It's like my favorite card in the deck next to the death card. It really is. And the Ten of Swords. Three favorite cards. Not because I like catastrophe or drama. Because I love it when painful things come to an end for people. I love it when the universe knocks problems out of the way. And I love it when old things come to an end so new things can be reborn. It's good energy. It's good mojo. It's good stuff. Fire, earth, air, water, speak truth, speak truth. 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 Eight of cups, ten of nine of pentacles in the reverse. Chickens and eggs. What came first? Did someone leave and that's when the tower fell? Or did they leave because the tower was about to fall? Somebody left. One more. They're sideways. This is more. Okay, they're both. Something was revealed. Someone grew impatient. One on just the Seven of Pentacles. One just. Page of Wands reverse, Chariot reverse, Stuck, Stagnation. Someone grew impatient. I feel like somebody left some stuck, stagnant energy. I don't know if it was you or them, but down went the tower. It's nobody's fault. These things just happen. And like I said, these things happen for a reason. It happened for your benefit. It did not feel like it in the moment. It may not feel like it yet, but it happened for a reason. And it is for your benefit. Let's keep going. Ace of Pentacles reversed. Page of Pentacles reversed. The devil. Mm. Energetic binds. Energetic ties that bind could be a Capricorn, that damn devil. The Tower Scorpio energy, by the way. Five of Wands reversed. It literally just flew out. You saw it fly. You saw it fly and land exactly where it was supposed to go. There's no do-over. There's no start over. Despite the ties you have, you're done with the drama. You're done with the fighting. You're done with the arguing. You're done. You're spent. King of Swords. 
logic first, emotion later, you're done. Cut and dry, you're done. There is no do-over. Ace of Cups reversed. Ace of Cups reversed. Taking that sword, cutting the ties that bind. They could be the mother or father of your children. You could well be married to this person. <sighs> Why death reversed? Seven swords reversed. There are no pentacles and no cups left. There's nothing left. There's nothing left. There's nothing to start over with. Either in their eyes or yours. No matter what they say, nothing has changed. Nothing has changed for you. You're done. One more on death reversed. They're going to throw everything at you to get you to change your mind. I'll work on it. Eight pentacles. We can work on it. We can work on it. Two of wands at the bottom of the deck. You have a choice to make. Somebody walked away. I feel like somebody, even before the tower fell, that could have been the catalyst of the tower falling. Somebody got sick and impatient of the stuck stagnant energy and they walked away. They walked away from somebody else's investment. Somebody else's time. Throwing everything at you. Queen of Wands. Interesting card to play. But the Queen of Wands knows, knows what she wants and she gets it. She knows what she wants. She goes after it. She works for it. She works toward it. Why is temperance here? Because you processed what you needed to process. Five cups. You cried your river of tears. You cried your ocean of tears. Two swords. Mm, still indecisive. Knight of swords. King of cups. It's not that you don't love this person. I'm catching a vibe that you know that they're going to ride in and say whatever they're going to say and they're going to ride out again. Yes, you have emotion for this person. But you need to bring yourself back into balance. You need to be at peace with yourself, Libra. Strength reversed, you're drained. Nine of Swords at the bottom of the deck. There's anxiety here. There's no aces to start over with at this point. The sun. Huh. There's a light at the end of the tunnel. There's something to rejoice. Why this three of cups? Why this three of cups? Talk to me about this three of cups. Could be a card of reunion. Could be a card of rejoicing. The world. Allowing an old cycle to end so a new cycle can begin. It is the 21st card.
tower fell for a reason. Page of Swords reversed and the lovers. Oh gosh, the lovers. Sometimes the Page of Swords, especially when he's reversed, tells you things you don't want to hear, but you might need to hear them. You have a choice to make. The old cycle has come to an end. What's new? So I guess you have to decide what came first, the chicken or the egg. So what comes next? A chick. A chick. Eight of Swords Reverse, don't put too much thought into it. Ace of Wands, Emperor, Page of Swords Reversed again. Page of Pentacles. You need to let go of control. The sun. Libra, I'm having a hard time discerning who ran out of the tower screaming before it fell. Who saw the storm coming and left? I guess it depends on your story. But the sun will shine again, but you have to let go of control. You have to let the last wand drop before you can pick up the ace. Sometimes that means having difficult conversations. Four of wands reversed and leaving the rubble on the ground. Star reversed, where you prevent your healing Justice reversed, and it's just imbalance. Being content and at peace with it. Nine cups at the bottom of the deck. Don't get out of your. Don't get it so much into your head. Don't hold on. Nine of Wands, Three of Wands. Keep your guard up, but wait for your moment. Five of Pentacles, the Emperor, and the Queen of Cups, and the Two of Cups. Pick your moment. Could be a card of reunion. Could be reunion. But I don't see victory at the end of this battle. And the Ten of Cups are still upside down. Six of pen six cups at the bottom of the deck. That's nostalgia. That's the beautiful memories. You need to hang on to those beautiful memories, but it may be time to take action and decide whether or not you're going to move forward and. No place like home. Number 50. Number 50. Okay. Authenticity, coming home to yourself, feeling at home, arriving at a place where you just fit, being comfortable in your own skin. The tower fell. Hold on. Home feels safe and secure. It's a comfortable place to rest and create a place that is known and you know can call yours. And you can call yours. This card signals that your ability to trust yourself and feel at home in your own skin is beginning to solidify as you claim your dignity and integrity aspects of yourself no one can take away from you. You know who you are. You hold your head high yet neither pride nor humility, yet with neither pride nor humility. You stand as the observer, seeing through the eyes of the soul, 
This puts you in position of power and strength. Authenticity is your home. You are safe here. In the house of your spirit and spirit. Libra. The house may have fallen, but you know where home is. So you need to take action and decide if you want to clear the rubble or rebuild with old bricks. Know that you're loved. Be blessed. Take care of yourself. I will catch you in the next. Hard to say when that will be. Big Mama says just getting her mojo back. So take care. Catch you next time.